post game press conference, uh, Minnesota State versus Northern State. Joining us, uh, Jerry Nash, the third, number 29, Nate Gunn, number 23, and head coach Todd Hoffer. We'll start with uh, comments from Coach Hoffer, please. Thank you, PA. Um, great to have a shutout. I'm very proud of our defense and defensive effort. Um, I think it's Coach Glow's first shutout since he's been here, which is outstanding. Every coordinator, obviously, uh, defense wants to pitch a shutout. I thought we did a phenomenal job in the beginning of the game, going three for four uh, in the first half, only receiving four drives, but taking three of them uh, to pay dirt, getting a couple of two-point conversions, which is good. We failed on one of them. Uh, going into half with a 22 to nothing lead uh, was important. And I thought the second half, and Coach Bashaner and the offensive group taking the ball down and uh, um, taking it to the end zone uh, in the first drive was really important to trying to put another nail in the coffin and, and seal the deal. Thanks. Questions? Uh, Coach Hoffman, uh, you guys are about a third of the way into the season now. Where do you see you guys' progress so far? You know, I think we've been making a lot of progress. I think um, uh, as a team, we keep developing. I think uh, the youth that we do have on the team with their, the younger guys are now becoming more mature. And uh, we do have some older guys that are maybe new as Mavericks that are transfers that are doing a phenomenal job of not only uh, providing great play, but also great leadership. Uh, and we have a, a solid group of juniors and seniors that are doing a phenomenal job of leading and helping these younger players. I feel like we're a really nice, tight-knit family right now. And ironically, it is family weekend. And uh, I thought that we really were playing for each other and we really care about each other. And, and it, and it's starting to show. Coach, was there anything specific about this game and the run that you kept going back to? What were what was Northern State really giving you that you really liked on the ground that you kept going back to? You know, I thought all of our backs, and especially Nate, did a great job of finding the holes. I think the offensive line and our receivers are doing a really good job of downfield too. Uh, and you're you're very rarely can you leave the backfield and not get touched and score a touchdown. So it speaks volumes to Nate's speed but also uh, just everybody doing their job and blocking everybody possible. But you also have to have that vision. Uh, and I think Nate's doing a fine job of finding the, the holes now to pinpoint exactly where they're at. Uh, it changes from play to play, but I think uh, vision is really important for a back success and finding those holes. And I think Nate's doing a great job. And then Ryan had a really good job, had a really good day at quarterback. Uh, how have you liked his development over the course of the season thus far? And uh, just how much has he grown just in kind of controlling the offense over these few games? Yeah, I thought, I thought today might have been on the surface, you know, until you get to nitpicking and watching each play and looking at the reads that he should have done or didn't do, whatever it may be, that's hindsight. But uh, from a live snapshot, watching it live, I thought there was a lot of impressive stuff out there. And uh, we've got two great quarterbacks, and, and I think both of them will do very well. But I thought Ryan did a very nice job today. Nate, can you uh, go through uh, that first play from the scrimmage? I mean, we uh, we already, you know, defense went out there. They did their job. I think that they set the tempo good for us going out. We told uh, them when we huddled up before we snapped, me and Ryan both told them the offensive line, like, you know, let's calm down. Let's do what we do. Do and, uh, what we prepared for. And the hole was good. I mean, we have wide receivers blocking downfield. So, you know, it just worked out. Can you tell, can you tell when? Ryan's really hitting the throws, the defense kind of loosening up throughout the game, and those holes just keep it being there throughout the game. Oh, yeah, we like, uh, we just don't wear you guys down, people down. I mean, that's, I think, big for us. Uh, we got guys that can catch the ball outside, guys that can throw, we got backs that can run in. I mean, we just gonna wear you down wherever we can. Ash, heading into this game plan, what was kind of a couple of things you wanted to make sure you did defensively? Uh, defensively, we wanted to respect our opponent. Um, Obviously, you know, Northern doesn't have the reputation that Duluth has, and everyone was questioning, you know, are they going to be able to get over Duluth that win? Are they still celebrating? You know, are they going to come in sloppy? And I think we kind of made it a point to start fast and uh, finish faster with them. So <clears throat> on the defensive side, we just wanted to play a 1,000 miles per hour and uh, play physical. So. And then for both of you guys, what did it mean to have really good days on the weekend? Nate, would you like to start? I mean, it's big. I mean, we've talked about it all week, you know, do it for the Mad Fam. That's kind of our slogan. And uh, before we can do it for you know, our people back at home, we got to do it for the family that's out on the field with us every day. So, uh, people that we're huddling up with, you know, me and Jerry, he does it for Coach Hoffman, I do 
the coach I know y'all know build all together. It was it was big for us. Um, like like Nate said, you know, and Coach Coach Hoffman said we're a family on that field first, and then it spreads throughout the school, and then our personal families being there, um, our coaches' families being there. So it, it meant the world, especially to get a shutout with. Defensively, Jerry, no interceptions, no uh, homework goes for it. So Not today. Up, up until this game, you've been the only one. It's kind of nice to see when else start to contribute. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's uh, it, it was it was nice that uh, I didn't have to. <laughs> I didn't have to, but um, no, all around the defense played great, and we got a, a bunch of guys in rotating, and that was nice to see those younger guys step up and make those big plays. So that was big for them. Okay, thanks guys. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.